Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Justin Kelsey, welcome back. And in today's video, I have got an amazing video to get you guys some extra profit. So of course, the weekend event is Wonders of Gond. So this is the mystery item that everyone wants to try and get, is upgrading or refining the little wondrous grommets that you get, and then hopefully trying to get themselves a mount. Well... That probably isn't going to be happening because you're going to be spending a lot um, or at least quite a bit of money on preservation wards and the actual chance at the end to get the stuff. However, I have got another way for you guys to get some extra cash. So, as you can see, I've just picked up a Wondrous Gromit. So, we're going to go in here and as you can see, I've got 14 of them. So, we need to split one off. You actually need six in total to get one to full. So, what you're going to want to do is uh, put four in here. So, you get the maximum refinement points. And then one to 100% upgrade it. So, we do that. We put it into this. We do this one. And I will actually just do one more just to show you guys as well. And... Um, Basically what you're going to be doing is you're going to be refining these bad boys and then putting them up on the market and getting yourself some extra money. However, I will be showing you guys a little tip if you do actually want to try and get yourself a chance of making these bad boys and getting the amount itself. So we're going to go on the trade house and uh, we're going to actually browse at the um, event items themselves and uh, go on buy now and you can buy... Tw wow, 22 of them for 2,500. So that is roughly uh, 22. Yeah, it's about 113. That's really good, actually. I might buy that, actually. Get that now. That's mine. So um, we've just made quite a bit of money off that. Um, so we're going to be buying and sort of selling these ones. As you can see at the minute, they are 483 uh, per one. And um, you could stand by your um, your post and buy them and sell them um, for profit. I mean, that's okay. But the best thing to do is just upgrade it. Spend the time that you can to upgrade it and get it to a cog. Because the cogs actually sell for about 4,000, 5,000. Oh, you know you wouldn't find one when you try. Um, but obviously this event has nearly been up... Um, like 20 yeah there we go so 3800 so you've made yourself 3800 straight off the bat instantly so that is a really nice one to do to actually get you some extra cash as well as if you go into the professions items at the minute your event and um, the special one is going to be this one um, and you will get yourself a sprocket five grommets and two cogs so the sprocket i think um we're going to check how much that sells for um, but, I mean, this is a really great thing to do this weekend. Yeah, there we go. So, uh, around 6,000 each. 6,500, 7,000 each. So, you will make yourselves quite a bit of profit if you have got the professions resources for that one. Um, as well as, as I say, you could make them yourselves and do it. But, um, it's a, it's a bit of an ache to get it. And also, if you get halfway through and you're like, oh, I'm sick of refining and stuff like that, then you're going to be wasting some money, extra money on it as well. But with the double refinement weekend on as well, uh, double refinement, double enchantments on this weekend as well, it's a double advantage to go out there and actually just farm because you will get refinement points. At the minute, I am using them to get up this one, this bad boy, uh, get it up as much as possible and uh, just to keep grinding grinding out until the maze engine comes out which is what we're all waiting for the next update that's going to be hitting xbox um neverwinter which we're all excited about anyway guys if this video has helped you out and possibly made you quite a bit of profit then hit that like button subscribe for the channel for more stuff just like this and as always guys i will see you next time